forward from Zarek. A flick from Abu Zaid. And then Wilkins, stronger than Tarek in the tackle. Gordon Cowan's absolutely thrilled to be here and linking up with England again. Sansom and Hayley. And beaten away by El Fatal. Stephen, England lead. And their first goal on African soil goes to Trevor Stephen. After 13 minutes. Egypt couldn't cope with the power of Hayley. And although El Batal punched the ball out, Trevor Stephen following up provided the perfect finish. Magdi. Egypt's best spell so far. And Stephen thought twice about closing down Tarek. And he got away from him. Atem, the fine header. And an athletic save from Peter Shilton. Atem, who's called in in the last moment to replace the injured El Khatib, almost contributing an equaliser. Shilton to England's rescue. Tarek. Yassi. And Abu Back from Omar. Sterling works from Shilton again. Asef. Egypt wants a penalty this time and they're not going to get it. Well, a fixture that has had some criticism, really, in terms of whether it would be useful to England. It's certainly compelling enough here in the first half of the first half, with England leading through Trevor Stephen, but Peter Shilton having to save twice at his very best to keep Egypt at bay. And here's Tannock again. And Fennick can only direct it back whence it came. Hassan and Chilton a third time. He's keeping England alive. Hassan again showing his strength in the air. But there's the strength of Chilton for all to see. much in the manner which led to England's goal, but this time the goalkeeper secured the ball. Wilkins, there's a lot of room in midfield if England can control the ball. Oh, an own goal surely by Omar! A gift for England from the Egypt right back. A desperate moment for him. A very fortunate one for Bobby Robson's side. After 41 minutes. Hanson has jogged forward ahead of Fennec. Try and give England extra numbers in attack. Cowan. Wilkins. That was shrewdly done. Instantly done too from Ray Wilkins for Trevor Stephen. And Wyatt marks his first international game with a goal he's been showing a scoring touch for Southampton recently five goals in his last five club games and he's brought that touch with him here to Cairo delight for Wallace 3-0 in the 52nd minute that was Zaid Times he has made the England goalkeeper be on his toes. Beardley allowed to turn. And here's Cowan. Given time to strike it, and he struck it very cleanly indeed. And that's a tremendous moment for Cowan. 
who was thrilled to be called back by Bobby Robson and to celebrate that call with a goal really icing his cake